Attention, air traffic control. A flock of eagles is heading to Arizona. <laughs> the day is today. I only want you to think about one thing. Everything you went through to get here. Everything we did to get here. In 2022, the Philadelphia Eagles reached the Super Bowl for the fourth time in franchise history. The 57th Super Bowl is underway. It was the culmination of a season that defied expectation and explanation. A magical year best understood by longtime fans of the team. a good football team. We know when we control the things we can, we damn good. Damn good. It's picked off. It's James Bradbury. The 2022 Eagles recorded a franchise record 14 wins. On offense, they scored the most points in team history. On defense, they registered the most sacks. Key ingredients to their success were all-out hustle. And Aaron Sippus, the holder, the saving tackle. A fanatical fan base. And a short yardage play that could not be stopped. Hurts will sneak. Dallas Goddard behind him. He pushes the race car into the end zone. Behind it all was a coach with a simple mantra. For each other. Yep. Oh, Woo! for each other. All right, we're for each other. That's better motivation than anything. We're for each other. Star in your role. That's what great teams do. In the end, a group of men came together to forge one of the most memorable seasons in team history. The Eagles' 2022 season took wing with a ferocious battle at Detroit. Goff lets it fly, and it is intercepted! Running with the football is Bradbury! Pick six, touchdown! But making the Lions look silly was more difficult than it appeared. Hurts made it look easy, and the Eagles will open the season with a unbelievable win here in Detroit. They won, but they escaped. Last season, Jalen Hurts made playing quarterback look so easy. I could be a quarterback. Just about everyone thought they could do it. Hurts back again. He is going deep for Quez Watkins, who has it, goes in for the touchdown. Hurts fakes, dives, lunges, and he's in for the touchdown. Hurts, and he runs with the football and keeps it. In a breakout primetime performance, Hurts threw for a score and rushed for two more. Takes it across the five and rolls down to the two. And is he in? Yes! He is. Touchdown, Jalen Hurts! Hurts' performance tonight ranks among the best Eagles quarterback performances we've ever seen. I will certainly co-sign that. Helping Hurts burst into stardom was a surrounding cast of big-time playmakers. Swings it out to Goddard. Goddard gets a block. Goddard on his feet at the 10. At the 5. Touchdown! At receiver, Hertz found a valuable new target for his first touchdown as an Eagle. Completes it, leading in, it's a touchdown to A.J. Brown. On the other side, 
Second-year phenom Devontae Smith racked up a career-high 169 yards. He went high in the air and came down at the two. Devontae Smith giving up his body. Hurts looking. Hurts firing. Devontae Smith touchdown. Again, he went skyward. Philadelphia's offensive dominance was matched on the other side of the ball. Lentz backs up. He steps up. He starts to run. He fumbles the football. Recovered by the Eagles. Carson Wentz, they're going to make sure that he is uncomfortable. They keep the pressure on him. The defense racked up a season-best nine sacks. They are killing the Washington offensive line. They've got him again! It was as one-sided as it sounds. In week four, the weather outside grew frightful. The rain will be off and on all afternoon. At times, it is very heavy. It's getting a little chilly out. Damn! Doug Peterson, the head coach responsible for bringing a Super Bowl to Philadelphia, has returned to the link. In the eye of the storm was Hassan Reddick, who pulled off a pair of tie-turning plays in the fourth quarter. Lawrence straight back. Lawrence looks. Lawrence hit. He fumbles the football, and I believe the Eagles have it. They do. They do. Hassan Reddick made the hit. Hey, this it. This it right here. This it right here. With the game on the line, Reddick came through again. Jawan Taylor, the right tackle, has had enough of Hassan Riddick. He fumbles the football. The Eagles have it. That'll be the game. You put the honest on your defense, and they truly come through. Go in and get dry and get warm. From chilly Philly, the Eagles flew to the Valley of the Sun, where they continue to slug it out. Her sneaks again. Dallas got it behind him, and they're just going to help him into the end zone. The most painful part of the afternoon for the Cardinals came with 22 seconds left. This is basically to send this game into overtime. Ball is spotted. The kick is underway, and the kick is... No good. No good. He missed it. He missed it. The Eagles are going to be 5-0. Oh, my goodness. How you feel? Good. <laughs> I'm a dollar, man. Huh? Let's go get a dollar, then. Both these teams think that they are the best in the division. They both get an opportunity to prove it right here tonight. And the boys over there, boy. It goes to Sanders. Pushing, pulls. He's in for the touchdown. Oh! Hell of a play, kid. Hell of a play. Ertz takes the snap. He fakes. He fires. He's got Brown, who beats a man at the five and slashes them for the touchdown. This is one of the best red zone defenses in all of football, the Dallas Cowboys. So you have to come up with something clever. It goes into the end zone. Touchdown, Devontae Smith. Keep finishing. Keep finishing. Football guys take care of the teams to finish. Plus takes the snap. In week six, the secondary corralled the Cowboys passing game. He is going deep, and it is intercepted. They're caught by Gardner Johnson. It's a great hit by Brandon Graham on the quarterback, so he's not going to get a lot on that throw. And as they say, that's all, folks. The Eagles have notched number six. What was on the horizon for the Eagles when they began the second half of the season at Houston? Another franchise first. Hurts. He is firing, and it is a touchdown, A.J. Brown. And the Philadelphia Eagles, for the first time in their long storied history, are 8 and 0. But Philadelphia's unblemished record would be sullied for the first time against Washington. In Indianapolis, the Eagles trailed by 10 in the fourth quarter until Jalen Hurts led a pair of scoring drives. Fire. Complete, and it is a touchdown! Quez Watkins! A 
minute and 29 seconds remaining. Game on the line. Hurts takes the snap. He's back. He's going to run. He's in. Touchdown. Jalen Hurts. Where would they be without him? The Eagles have trailed all game, have taken a 17-16 lead. They escaped. It took all 60 minutes, and we were behind the entire game until the end. Until the end. We still have yet to play a complete game. We got to continue to challenge ourselves and push ourselves to get to that point. Cheering cheeseheads of the Philly cream variety, watch Hertz break the single game franchise record for rushing yards by a quarterback with a career high 157 against Green Bay. That's the Jalen Hurts running show, and he makes the Packers pay. The offense pounded out a season-best 363 rushing yards, the most by any Eagle team since 1948. Again, Merrill, it's the offensive line. This is Jeff Stoutland University's boys just getting after it at the line of scrimmage. You think? And it is caught and backing in his place one pitch for the touchdown. In the last few games, he has come to life. And the Eagles are 10 and 1. And we saw a record setting night from Jalen Hurts. He set the franchise record. We got Randall Cunningham, right? We got Michael Vick, right? There's been some great, great quarterbacks rushing here. And he set that record, so that was awesome. Hey. Everybody on that offensive line came off. With the best record in the NFL, the Eagles were no longer flying undetected. We come out here today, we don't have to do nothing but one thing. Everybody do their job, and we'll be the best team ever. He is going deep, and it is caught by Devontae Smith into the end zone. Touchdown! Yeah! That I was going to be on today. First is back. He's looking. Still looking. Still looking. Now he's going deep to A.J. Brown. Who catches it and walks in for a touchdown. Take that, former team. Do it again, AJ. Hurts, back, pumps, looks. He is floating it deep for A.J. Brown, who has it. He took it. And he scores. A.J. Brown took it away and scored his second touchdown of the game. <laughs> AJ, aren't you glad you play in Philadelphia? Yeah, I'm feeling it, baby. Let's get it. We love you. On special teams and defense, Philly dominated Tennessee from start to finish. Yeah! They got him again! Hey, that might have been our most complete game as a team, right there. We showed the entire NFL who the most physical team is in the NFL. Yes. If you hear me yelling like uh, Bobby Boucher, that's no, that's me. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 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 my God. I went in like the water boy. I said 51. <laughs> Fourth down of seven. Floating it to Devontae Smith, who makes the catch. The Giants miss, and he walks into the end zone. In the hunt for the NFC's number one seed, the Eagles posted their highest point total of the season. Wow. Miles Sanders rushed for a career-best 144 yards. Miles Sanders, touchdown! Eagles laying it on the Giants today. Yeah! Miles went over 1,000. AJ went over 1,000. That was fun. That was a fun, that was a fun game. Hurts calls for the football. He's going to run. Goodbye! Touchdown, Jalen Hurts. Wasn't a Rembrandt, as they used to say, but the Eagles will take it. But a shoulder injury hurt sustained in a win at Chicago would force him to sit out the next two games, both losses. So the Eagles will have to wait another week. This is all going to boil down to the last game of the regular season. The Eagles need a win next Sunday. Absolutely. It means a bye and it means home field. Come 
out here and dominate from whistle to whistle every snap. Hurts returned in week 18. He gives it off to Scott. Up the middle. Touchdown! The giant killer does it again. <laughs> His presence and five Jake Elliott field goals were enough for the win. The Eagles have clinched the first seed in the NFC. They are 14 and 3, and they finally got the job done. We got the most wins in franchise history, but we want so much more. Yes, sir. So much more. The team that roared through the season at a 14 and 3 clip beats their rivals of 90 years, the New York Football Giants. Take a deep breath, ladies and gentlemen. It's playoff football. Can't get tired of whooping ass. Can't get tired of whooping ass. Dallas Goddard spinning across the goal line into the end zone. The Eagles score. At the start of the playoffs, Philadelphia raced to a 28 to nothing lead against the Giants and never looked back. The Philadelphia Eagles have reached the NFC Championship game. We ain't going nowhere yet, baby. We ain't ready to go home yet. Another opportunity. Lay everything on the line. These are once in a lifetime opportunities we got right in front of us in our hands. So what you gonna do? The NFC Championship, the two best teams of the NFC are about to collide. Brock Purdy just gets hammered by Hassan Riddick. In the NFC Championship, an injured elbow sidelined 49ers quarterback Brock Purdy. While San Francisco's offense sputtered, Philly's attack hit its stride. They go to Scott, tries to sleep. He pushes forward. He is in for the touchdown. Eagles are going to the Super Bowl! I want to hear Mary Reese say that. Attention, air traffic control. A flock of Eagles is heading to Arizona. Jump in there. Hey, downtown, you better grease the poles. This is going to be a celebration. We're getting ready to go to another Super Bowl, and it feels good. It feels good, and that's what I say. One more, baby. One more. Philadelphia's opponent in Super Bowl 57 could not have been more familiar. Come on, big guy. Love you. Love you, big guy. Both Kelseys become the first set of brothers to play against each other in Super Bowl history. Looking deep. He wants A.J. Brown. And it is caught for a touchdown. A.J. Brown. <laughs> Let's go. First lead. 14 to 7. First and goal of the four. Hertz is going to run and score. <laughs> the Eagles built a 10-point halftime yeah. lead. So far, so good. Burns, 24, Chiefs, 14. Don't be excited yet. A lot of ball left, you know what I mean? And they're a really good team. But in the fourth quarter, Patrick Mahomes engineered two scoring drives to give the Chiefs a late lead. We have 922 remaining in regulation. Keep playing. Let's finish. Let's say nothing but what we've been doing all year. They must make this drive count. Jalen Hurts. He is going deep. And Devontae Smith is out of bounds at the one. Run that thing one more time. They line up. They push. And they are in for the touchdown. Now, they have to go for two. They're down 35-33. Hurts is going to run. And he is. Here the Eagles would get the ball back after a key third down stop. Mahomes, he is firing, and it is incomplete, but there's a penalty flag thrown. And I think it's going to be defensive holding against the Eagles. You are right. Prior to the pass, holding, number 24. Automatic, first down. 
Was it the right call? That will be debated in Philadelphia for all time. We're going to call that? Yeah. That's game. It looked so good for so long, but here is Butker, 27-yard field goal. The ball is spotted. Oh, the kick is up, and the kick is good. And the Kansas City Chiefs have won another Super Bowl. It appears that the wrong team won. Eagles worked so hard to come here. They had an outstanding season. Frustration at its utmost. But you have to take your hat off to the Kansas City Chiefs. I had to come get you. Yeah, I love, hey, you. love you too, man. Oh, right you there. deserve that right there, man. That might be the best Super Bowl ever. Right you there. deserve that right there. How high the Eagles soar in the future remains to be seen. But with a roster of talented youngsters and veteran leaders, supported by the NFL's most fanatical fans, you can be sure the men in green will be back in 2023 to give it another go.